friends, I'm Madeline Bowman from the Lower Dauphin Communities That Care Bookmobile and today I'm going to show you everything I do to get the bookmobile ready to go on the road. Follow me inside, we'll turn the generators on first. As you see, it's very dark in here, but we're going to turn the generators on and then turn the lights on. First, the generator to get some power. You'll hear a big rumble. There it is. Now I can turn the lights on. And now, friends, what I do is go outside to inspect the entire area of the bus and under the hood. Stay tuned. Now that I have turned the generators on and I have the lights going, now I'm going to look under the hood because I have to check the engine to make sure the bookmobile is safe to run. So come on and, and I'll show you what I do. First, I have to unhook. And around this side, the same type of latch. And then we have a special handle. And let's look under the hood. What we are looking for here, my friends, is that all of our cables, all of our hoses, all of the engine parts are um, exactly the way they should be and safe to run. We look at all of our um, different fluids. Come to the other side and I'll show you. From here we see our coolant and oh, it looks like our windshield wiper fluid is a little bit low, so I'll have to put some more in. Next, we will check the tires. Before I check the tires, I've got to close everything up. So big heave ho. We have to make sure our hood is latched. One latch, let's do the other one. second latch. Now it's safe. Let's check the tires. Okay, now friends, we're going to check out all the tires and all the wheels all the way around the bus, so follow me. What I'm looking for is to make sure that the tires are inflated and make sure everything is where it should be. So this one is okay. Let's go check the back. On the way, I look to make sure that there are no dents and no um, damage to the bus. Oh, take a look at this. Everything looks good. I also look underneath. You won't be able to see it very well, but I also check my air brake system. Air brakes sound like big tractor trailers. You'll see in just a few minutes. Come around back and let's take a look. From the back of the bus, I look at everything that is here. We have our emergency door, our emergency handle, our backup camera. These are our emergency steps. And I take a look underneath to make sure everything is where it should be. Come on around, let's check the other tires. Taking a look. Everything looks great. Let's go check the front one. Everything is good here. Now let's go inside and check the air brake system. This is really fun. Hello friends. Now that we've checked the outside of the bus, now it's time for me to check everything on the inside of the bus and to make sure my brakes and all my lights are working properly. So let's take a look. First of all, you notice that my steering wheel is way up high. This is really kind of cool. I have a special lever that I pull the steering wheel down so that I can use it. Second of all, before I start off, because it's a hot day, I'm going to turn our air conditioners on. There we go, that'll make it a lot more pleasant for us. So first thing we do, because we have a diesel engine, we are going to turn our key to run. 
and let it cycle through. And then we're going to crank the bus. Some things that I look for, um, I listen to how it cranks. I also check all of my levers, my air pressure for my air brakes, and you hear my special radio that is connected to the school system. So if I ever needed help on the road, they would come out and help. I take a look at my fuel gauges, my water, oil, all of my gauges look absolutely fine the way they're supposed to be. The next thing we're going to do is check our brakes. Listen up and you'll hear them. Oh, there it was. First, I'm going to push in my parking brake. That is what helps keep the bus in the same place when I park it. I'm going to push it. Make sure, no, it's still working great. And I'm looking at my gauges and I'm making sure that there are no leaks in my air brake system. Everything is looking good. Now I'm going to pump my brakes to get all of the air out of it. I'm going to hear a ding. There we go. That's working well. That's my alarm system. And then in just a few moments, you'll see my parking brake. There it goes. That's what it's supposed to do. And that's what I have to double check. Turn it off, turn it back on, wait for it to cycle through, and then I can crank the bus. Okay. The next thing I'm checking are all of my mirrors. You notice I have a lot of mirrors. I can see everywhere around the bus and all of my mirrors, and here, in my mirror is my backup camera so I know that what is behind me and now I check my seat belt that is working properly we are almost ready to go I have a few more things to check though now that I've checked the brakes and the engine I'm going to fill out my daily inspection checklist and this gives um, everybody an idea. It reminds me of everything that I have to check and I check it daily. Okay. Now I'm gonna go back and check to make sure everything is put away before I hit the road. Follow me back. Come on. You might see there's uh, a lot more on board the bus besides books. That is because right now we are, are closed um, as a library, but we're using the bookmobile to deliver Falcon Packs to all of our communities. So take a look at our website if you like the schedule. Let's make sure that everything is put away so it doesn't shift around while I drive the bus. I have to put my chair down so it doesn't roll. And we'll put this book away. Okay, it looks like we're ready to go. Okay, great, my friends. I'm going to put my sunglasses on because I always need them when I drive, especially in the summertime. And I have my mask for when we deliver our food. I don't need it while I'm driving because I'm by myself. But I will put it on when we are delivering food to keep myself and everyone else safe. My seatbelt. And remember my special pedal to pull my drivers, my wheel down. And now we're ready to go.